Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. The Chief of Air Staff in a recent interview with Financial Express Online has informed that Indian Air Force intends to increase the squadron's strength via the phased induction of Tejas, MRFA fighters and AMCA. He quoted that the improvement in technology capability and increase in the numerical strength are both long drawn process that require necessary financial support. Tejas itself includes three production variant namely Tejas Mark 1, Mark 1A and Mark 2. CAS has further informed that one squadron of IOC Tejas that is 16 Tejas Mark 1 has been inducted. Typically, one squadron has 18 fighters including two trainer aircrafts. The trainer aircrafts are to be built together including the one ordered for this Mark 1A. The total number of trainer aircrafts to be built are 8 from the initial order of this Mark 1 and 10 from the order of this Mark 1A. All these trainers are going to be of FOC standard. Now apart from 16 IOC Tejas, 9 FOC Tejas has also been inducted into Indian Air Force taking the total count to 25 Tejas inducted till date. By next year, Indian Air Force will induct 11 more FOC Tejas Mark 1, taking the total count to 36. This will also include 4 trainer aircrafts as a part of the initial order because HL will commence the production of trainer aircrafts once it has completed the 32 single-seater fighter jet production from the first order. The first squadron of Tejas, which includes 16 FOC Tejas Mark 1, was formed on the 1st July 2016 and second squadron, which includes 9 FOC Tejas, was formed on 1st April 2020. The 11th is Mark 1 that Indian Air Force is yet to induct are at advanced stages of production. Few months back, it was reported that HL is awaiting radars from Israel to be integrated into the aircrafts. These aircrafts, once assembled with remaining components, will undergo flight and user evaluation trial by Indian Air Force, post which it will be cleared for induction which is slated by next year. HL is also obliged to start delivery of this Mark 1 aircraft from 2024 onwards, exactly three years after signing of the contract in 2021 for the 83 this Mark 1A. In 2024, HL has to deliver 3 Tejas Mark 1A, that is, by 2024, HL has to deliver total 14 aircrafts, including 11 from the first order. This should be easily achievable, as the production of Tejas Mark 1 from the initial order is nearly complete. From 2025 onward, HL has to deliver 16 Tejas Mark 1A per year, which will complete the order of Tejas Mark 1A by 2029. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.